Hi kids! I am Teacher Mean. Welcome sa ating math tutorial. Let us discuss about the divisibility rules for 3, 6, and 9. For us to be able to find the factors of a given number, we must consider the rules about divisibility. So let's have first divisibility rule for 3. A number is divisible by 3 if the sum of the digits is divisible by 3. For example, we have 7. 7 is not divisible by 3. Why? So, if we are going to divide 7 by 3, so may botal siya. So, ibig sabihin, it is not divisible by 3. How about 27? We are going to find the sum of the digits. 2 plus 7, that would be 9. Since 9 is divisible by 3, then 27 is divisible by 3. How about 845? Let us find if it is divisible by 3. So, let us add the digits. 8 plus 4 plus 5, that would be 17. And then, if we are going to divide 17 by 3, that is 5 remainder 2, then this is not divisible by 3. How about 9,045? Let us now add the digits. 9, 4, and then 5. Okay? So, that would be 18. 18 divided by 3 is equal to 6. So, therefore, it is divisible by 3. Next, we have the divisibility rules for 6. A number is divisible by 6 if it is divisible by both 2 and 3. If a number is divisible by 2, kapag ang last digit niya ay even number. So, what are those even numbers? We have 0, 2, 4, 6, and 8. Again, how about 3? Kapag 3 naman, the sum of the digits is divisible by 3. For example, we have 18. The last digit of 18 is 8. 8 is an even number, so therefore, it is divisible by 2. If we are going to add the digits of 18, so 1 plus 8, that would be 9. 9 is divisible by 3, therefore, 18 is divisible by 6. If it is divisible by both 2 and 3, therefore, it is divisible by 6. Okay, next. How about 45? The last digit of 45 is 5. 5 is an odd number. So, therefore, it is not divisible by 2. Let us check if it is divisible by 3. So, adding the digits 4 and 5, that would be 9. 9 divided by 3 is 3. So, therefore, it is divisible by 3. Hindi siya divisible by 2, pero divisible by 3. Therefore, it is not divisible by 6. So, dapat parehas divisible by 2 at divisible by 3. Next would be 774. The last digit of 774 is an even number. So, therefore, it is divisible by 2. Next, let us find out if it is divisible by 3. Adding the digit 7, 7 and 4, that will give us 18. 18 divided by 3 is 6. So, therefore, it is divisible by 3. So, ibig sabihin, kung ito ay divisible by 2 at divisible by 3, 774 is divisible by 6. Next, we have 2,128. Ang last digit niya is 8, which is an even number. So, therefore, it is divisible by 2. Oh, let us check now if it is divisible by 3. So, adding the digits of 2,128, 2 plus 1 plus 2 plus 8, that would be 13. 13 is not divisible by 3. So, therefore, kahit na divisible siya by 2, ang sabi sa rule, 
If it is divisible by both 2 and 3, therefore, it is divisible by 6. So, yung 2,128 is not divisible by 6. Next, we have the divisibility rule for 9. A number is divisible by 9 if the sum of the digits is divisible by 9. For example, we have 36. Let us add the digit 3 and 6, that would be 9. 9 divided by 9 is equal to 1. So therefore, 36 is divisible by 9. How about 285? Let us add the digits 2, 8, and 5, that would be 15. 15 divided by 9 is 1 remainder 6. So therefore, it is not divisible by 9. Next example is 837. Kung ito ay divisible by 9, let us add 8, 3, and 7. That will give us 18. 18 divided by 9 is equal to 2. So wala siyang butal. So therefore, 837 is divisible by 9. How about 6,498? Let us add the digits. 6 plus 4 is 10. 10 plus 9 is 19. And then 19 plus 8 is 27. Is 27 divisible by 9? Yes. 27 divided by 9 is 3. So, walang butal. Therefore, 6,498 is divisible by 9. Music